and welcome to Altvin. Uh, I'm Frank Templeton, one of the founders here at Altvin, and today I thought what I'd do is showcase one of the um, really unique and powerful aspects of Altvin in the creative process. So let's just dive in and uh, open up one of these events, uh, and we'll go straight to one of the bottle runs uh, which I created earlier. So let's look at this one, chapter three. Uh, now I've not put anything in here, so I'm just gonna quickly put some information in so we can get it started. Save that away. And let's go and select our bottle. So what we're doing in the creative process here is actually putting a bottle together and we're gonna see just how fast that can occur um, in Altvin, uh, something that maybe take us under a minute uh, and in the real world probably take something along the lines of um, uh, maybe a lot, lot longer, maybe two or three days. Okay, so here we're gonna select from our bottle list and you can see it uh, has an range of bottles. It brings the bottle in. Uh, we've got a set of closures here we can go to. Uh, here I'm just gonna select a silver closure. I'm gonna put that in. And now we're gonna to go to the labels. You can see it's very uh, easy to follow. Uh, follows the normal course of wood in the real world. Uh, and here we're gonna upload a label. I can fill in a whole lot of other information but I'm just gonna see if I can get a label for us here. I'm gonna put it in. Um, Altvin's gonna to go to work in terms of processing that label. It's gonna bring us up, tell us what that size is. I'm going to change that size and make it say 100. And this is one of the unique things you can do in, in, in Altvin is that you can actually uh, go through and resize things, and get it to the way that you want it to be. Uh, and we're going to position that label 25 mil from the bottom. And we're not gonna rotate it at all. We're gonna save that away and we're going to design that bottle. And so Altvin goes to work now and actually shows us precisely what this bottle looks like with that label on there. And at the minute, it's rendering all those images for me so I can spin it and have a look at every angle around there. Now I might say, ah, oh, look, okay, I don't mind that. It doesn't look too bad, but I'd like to see what it looks like on a burgundy shaped bottle. So let's go through, change the bottle and we go down to uh, a little bit further down here. Let's pick an AG021 from Aurora. Select that bottle, it says to me, hey, look, you might have to change a few things because you've got that bottle selected because it's very different to a Bordeaux shaped bottle. We're gonna use the same uh, cap on it. And let's go back to that label. Now, keeping all the label information the same, we're just gonna press design bottle again. And again, Olfin's gonna go to work giving us, hey, wow, all of a sudden, I like the look of this bottle, it looks a lot better. Uh, and this is the power of Altvin, the ability to change and quickly do a rendering and know what it's gonna look like in a matter of seconds. Um, you know, and, and this power is just incredible. So let's go back and say, yes, I like this, but also let's change the closure. Okay, so let's go, we'd like say a red closure on there instead and maybe see what that'll actually look like. Uh, so we go back to our labels section we can simply press the design bottle again. It's gonna to go to work, give us exactly what we're talking about. So what you've seen here is the power in Altvin. There's a lot more to show, but at least it gives you some sort of sense of exactly what can be achieved inside Altvin. Okay, thanks guys.